Hi, my name is Alice Wang and welcome to Cuisine Insight. Today we're making butternut squash cupcakes with chocolate frosting. Here I have some butternut squash, nice and chopped. We have all-purpose flour, some cinnamon, some nutmeg, some sugar, some brown sugar, a little salt, some organic eggs from Trader Joe's, some applesauce, some pistachios and chocolate chips, and a little bit of butter. So as I get started, I'm going to just run the butternut squash with the food processor. Turn it off. That was about two cups of squash. Just transfer the blade into this blade. What I'm going to do is start cracking some eggs. I'm going to process all this together. Get it all nice and blended, nice and smooth. Then I'll add my sugar, about a cup and a half of sugar. Some butter. You almost want it like a, you know, like a puree, nice and silky. Put everything back in a bowl and fold the dry ingredients in. A little cinnamon, nutmeg, and cloves, and some flour. Fold it all in. And of course, you don't ever want to overmix anything. It's always better to just give it some couple of strokes. Get all that flour in. What I got here is some applesauce just for some moisture and texture goes a long way with baking, especially in cupcakes. And then I got some chocolate chips and some nuts. So it's great, you got butternut squash, a little cinnamon, some cloves, great spices, great flavors for the season also. So you get all that incorporated But before I bake, I always taste, right? Make sure I have my salt and sugar. <laughs> it's really good. Okay. So I just take a spoon. Spoon it into my cupcake. In here. I'm gonna bake this at about 350 for 15 to 20 minutes. It's got a really, really nice buttery flavor. So you get all the textures, you got chocolate chip, you got nuts, you got the applesauce. Okay. He's in the oven. Okay. 350 for 15 to 20 minutes. That's it. That's it.